A good highway provides a comfortable ride, even and free from bumps and potholes. But it can't be too smooth. It must be rough enough to provide traction for safety. YDOT regularly tests for skid resistance using a weighted trailer with standardized tires to simulate a passenger car. We spray water under that tire for about a second or a half second, lock the tire up and drag it for one second and actually sample that data and from that we get a coefficient of friction of the road. Testing data is used to monitor weathering and wear on road surfaces and helps engineers determine where maintenance such as chip sealing or resurfacing may be needed. It basically quantifies it and gives them documentation to justify putting in a chip seal. We've also now done it on a more proactive thing where we have a slippery section of road or a bridge deck. Skid tests are performed every mile in both directions. Interstates are tested every year, while U.S. and state highways are tested every other year. On a normal test year, we are driving about 22,000 miles. We are collecting 9,000 skids, or basically testing about 4,500 miles of road in two directions. Reminding you to slow down in work zones and always buckle up. This is Doug McGee reporting.